What's good, everybody? It's your boy Big Guns for Hire, bringing you another game of Call of Duty Black Ops 3 Domination on the Maps uh, Hunted. And let's see what's popping, bro. I'm sitting here, man. As you can see, I started the match going straight to B, making sure that I can bring some cover for my teammates to capture B. I want to take the opportunity though, man, before I start with this commentary to uh, uh, congratulate uh, my boy Blood Ramson and, um, and Tactical Angel, man. They are acquiring a lot of subs in a short uh, period of time, man, and they are really, really uh, improving through through the time man they, they i mean they are really working hard and they are you know they they're getting some they're giving the the people some good product and um uh, i'm very very uh happy for them man i congratulate them and i'm thankful for the support that they have given me also on my channel you know with leaving comments and watching my videos and whatnot and um I also want to thank uh, um, that's Auto Man because he also stepped in and you know give me support and and watch my content. I appreciate it a lot. But uh, back to this gameplay, man. Uh, you guys can see I spent most of my game uh, in this area, making sure that nobody captures B uh, from the opposite team. And I, I found out to have most success playing this way, man. Um, because, you know, everybody wants to capture B and, uh, so I'm trying to keep, you know, bring people some cover, my teammates some cover and, and whatnot. But uh, sometimes, man, I ended up in these lobbies where I don't know what it is. It's like my teammates don't know, they don't know how to play domination or they just don't know how to play Call of Duty. And uh, this is one of those matches, man. I mean, I I went in, I did my part, but my teammates, man, they keep, you know, like not really playing the game the way they're supposed to play it. And you guys are gonna see, man, as the match pro, pro uh, progress, uh, you'll see what I'm talking about. I take, I took care of that guy over there trying to take B, and um, I spent. <clears throat> Most of my time behind the stroke, I found, found it to be a really good spot. And uh, I'm rocking the dingo with the suppressor, uh, the tiger finder, and also, which is called the BOA, BOE in this in this game, and uh, a grip. And and this seems to work really good in this in this uh, spot because I'm able to pick people off with my dot. And uh, and as I shoot at them, because I only need to worry about covering B, so the suppressor is uh, still pretty effective in this distance. And they have problems trying to find me, so it, it works. It works out lovely for me, man. You see, I, I keep my head on a swivel, making sure that nobody comes behind me or or, or trying to get me uh, out of this spot. And so far we're doing pretty well, man. I mean, we 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 have be well well covered. The other team is is is, is had no other option but to go for alpha. I'm sitting here taking down, uh, stop trying to take down the UAV. But uh, I had a I had a teammate, man, that he was doing the same thing. He was taking care of UAVs and whatnot. Um, in a way, I'm happy for for that. For for him doing that, but also like you know, come on, you know what I'm saying, and and trying to get me some easy, some some free cheese too. But um, like you can see, man, I don't understand why it took the team so long to get either A or B or C, man. I mean, it's ridiculous. Look at that. I took care of that guy trying to go for uh, Bravo. I mean, you know, we spawn like. Either close to A or close to C. As you, you look at that, what a beautiful head glitch. You saw that? I shot that guy right through the windshield, even though there's no glass there. But 
Uh, anyway, uh, I mean, we're spawning close to Charlie for what I see. And I don't understand why it took so long for them to, like, jump on Charlie, you know? But that's the end of the first round. We're going to go to the to the second round. And you guys saw how uh, the weapon we was giving these guys. I'm, I'm, I'm playing this on, um, on the uh, theater mode. You can see that we were beating these guys 167. Now, I decided to jump on Charlie on the second round because I'm trying to get my care package out. And I, I, I was able to do it. Now, I'm going to take my hives and I'm going to bring myself some protection. Put a, 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 a line of defense here so I can get my care package called, called FedEx. And let God, uh, I have Tom Hanks deliver my package. And now I'm trying to find a spot for it uh, right here, man. I can't seem to find a spot. But here we go. Uh, oh, uh, oh, here we go, right there. So I call on Tom Hanks. And I'm just waiting for him to get off the island and deliver my package. And here goes my package. Now they gave me a dart, but I switched that up real quick with the uh for the wraps and i got the wraps by luck and uh i put the wraps right into work and they did some they did some damage for me man i mean most of the time to tell you the truth look at that nice kill there to tell you the truth most of the time when i call the wraps people seems to be wearing a flat jacket or they're wearing um uh cold-blooded and and I just don't have that don't get that many kills. But in this in this match, man, I got lucky and people wasn't prepared for it. Cause I don't know if you know, but if you wear cold blooded, the rats will not kill you unless you get a, a teammate beside you that doesn't have cold blooded. So if you wanna avoid getting killed by the raps, the best option you could have is cold blooded with uh with flat jacket, just in case it's a teammate near you, uh, that flat jacket will keep you from uh, getting killed by the um, by the wraps. So there's just a little bit of info there in case you didn't know. But like you like you can see, I'm going back to the car now. I'm gonna when I got flash here, I was kind of upset. I'm gonna start wearing uh tactical mask man because I, I ain't getting tired of getting uh um flashed and getting um uh stunt and the stun the stun grenades are pretty strong here man and this is same thing with the flash i don't see too many people use the flash grenades but they are very very strong i'm gonna start i'm thinking about using them myself now that guy got lucky with that freaking um, 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 bomb or whatever the, that that thing is. My I just my, my I got brain freeze now. So I'm trying to make my way back to um, to the truck to the to the Ford pickup truck here and uh, protect B. And now uh, we we have had we had lost B. For a long time, now I got two guys went up there and capture it. So I'm sitting here, and you you know, like I say, I'm not gonna. Somebody have to watch out for for uh, people trying to get on B. You know what I'm saying? Um, so that's what I do. I sit back because I got an LNG. I sit back and I make sure and look over B to bring uh, support. For my teammates, so they can capture B. But uh, look at that guy. He he thought he was, you know, that all he had to worry about was those guys there. But uh, I'm behind this truck, man. I'm gonna take care of you real quick. Now me and this guy, he's behind the truck. I'm behind this truck, and we we having a a heated battle. I only eight bullets. He too afraid to pop his head out. So I decided to say, you know what? Let me get, let me reload, take the opportunity to reload real quick, and come back up and look at that. He he snitched on himself. Now I know he's on that side, and uh, this guy came in and he helped me out. I, we we just 
I couldn't took I I couldn't kill him. He couldn't kill me. You know, it was just like damn. You know, so anyway, man, we winning one sixty four to fifty eight, and uh, but you can see, man, we we keep losing alpha. These people keep pressing a uh, uh, home flag. And what upsets me is the fact that uh, we are not able to uh, to get the home flag like fast enough, man. Now we lose him. B. I noticed that I turned around to kill these two guys real quick, but I just I, I didn't turn around quick enough, man. That we lost B, and uh, we lost we just lost A. I got 88 bullets left. And I'm trying to, you know, maintain this this area clean without any intruders. And I'm just waiting for my team to come back, man, and capture B. They're just sitting by, back. I, I, you know, I see a guy there trying to get B. I'm trying to give him some protection. Now I got the hives again. So I'm going to lay down the hives by B to make sure they don't capture B again. And I'm going to turn around here. And I'm going to get my care pack as, as close to me as possible. And I'm hoping for something really good. Now, we're losing B again. But there was some guy there. And look at that. I got the service. Now, I laid down the service. I call it out. Trying to get it in there as quick as possible. And uh, here we go. That guy thought it was a care pack. And she was getting ready to pick it off. What, what a scumbag, man. But look at that. I'm trying to clean up B now. I don't know why the service is doing coming back to me where the action is like over there. I should have just... Um, I, I was counting on the service, man, to to give me some protection. And what, what I should have done, I should have just let the service continue on his own. And I should have just uh, hang back and wait till the service push forward a little bit. But as you can see, man, we lost by three points. And um, I just, at the, towards the end, I made a crucial mistake. Well, you know, we could have won this game, but it is what it is. Your boy finished 25 and 5. And uh, wow, dude, that unique guy, 8 and, tw and 32. Wow. Oh, well. Anyway, man, thank you for watching, man. Make sure you smash that subscribe button and uh, leave a comment. Let me know what you what you think of my commentary, uh, what how I can improve, and what would you like to see next. Peace and adios.